Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of star seeds. Are you one of them? Let's find out. Have you ever felt a deep longing for something more, like you don't quite belong here on Earth? Maybe you've always been drawn to the stars or have an unexplainable connection to the cosmos. Well, my friend, you might just be a star seed. In this video, we're going to break down seven signs that you might be a star seed sent here on a special mission. So buckle up, grab your cosmic latte, and let's explore the wonders of the universe within you. Okay, so the first sign you might be a star seed is this feeling of being a little out of place. Like, you love Earth and all its quirks, but something just feels off. It's like you're watching a movie with subtitles and you understand the gist, but you can't quite shake the feeling that you're missing some key cultural references. Star seeds often talk about feeling like they're from a different planet. And honestly, who can blame them? Our souls have journeyed through vast galaxies, so it's only natural to feel a little homesick for the cosmos. Think about it. Have you ever looked up at the stars and felt an overwhelming sense of peace and belonging? Like that's where you're truly meant to be? Or maybe you've always felt drawn to certain constellations or planets, like they hold a special significance for you. This, my friends, is not just your average case of wanderlust. This is your soul whispering to you about its cosmic origins, reminding you that you're a citizen of the universe here on a temporary assignment. And let me tell you, that assignment is gonna be epic. Now what do the elites, today's billionaires, and the ancient Egyptians know about manifesting unlimited money that you don't? Curious to learn more? I'll leave a link in the description below this video to discover the secret to getting exactly what you want in life. All right, star seed number two, you are an emotional champion. And by champion, I mean you feel everything. And I mean everything so deeply. Like you walk into a room and you instantly know if someone's energy is off. You're the friend everyone goes to for advice because you just get it. You cry during commercials, you laugh a little too loud at jokes, and you can sense when your bestie is about to have a meltdown before they even know it themselves. It's a gift and a curse. But hey, that's the thing about being a starseed. You're wired differently. You're here to experience the full spectrum of human emotions, the good, the bad, and the ugly cry face. You see, starseeds are natural healers and light workers. And your empathy is your superpower. You have the ability to understand and transmute energy in a way that most people can only dream of. So embrace your inner empath, my friend, because the world needs your compassion and understanding. Now chapter three is all about that inner voice, that gut feeling, that sixth sense, whatever you wanna call it, intuition. Star seeds, you guys have it in spades. It's like you have a direct line to the universe and you just know things. You ever get that feeling that something's not right even if you can't explain it? Or maybe you have a dream that comes true, down to the smallest detail. That's your intuition, babe, and it's trying to tell you something. Trust me, I've learned the hard way to listen to my intuition. It's like having a cosmic GPS guiding you through life. But sometimes you ignore the directions and end up lost in a cornfield of bad decisions. Don't be like me. Listen to your gut. It's usually right. Starseeds, your intuition is a gift. Use it wisely. The universe is always trying to communicate with you, to guide you on your path. So pay attention to those subtle signs, those synchronicities, those random thoughts that pop into your head. You never know where they might lead you. Chapter 4 is for all my fellow space cadets out there. Starseeds, you guys are obsessed with all things celestial. Astrology? Sign me up. Documentaries about black holes? Yes, please. You could spend hours staring at the stars, pondering the mysteries of the universe. And it's not just a passing interest, it's a deep-seated fascination with where we came from and what lies beyond our little blue planet. You see, 
Star seeds have a cosmic perspective. You understand that we are all connected, that every living thing is made up of the same star stuff. You're drawn to ancient wisdom, to spiritual practices that connect you to the divine, to anything that helps you tap into the infinite energy of the universe. So go ahead, embrace your inner space nerd. Read all the books, watch all the documentaries, and never stop asking those big existential questions. The universe loves a curious mind. Chapter five. That time I saw a UFO, maybe. Okay, this next sign of being a starseed is a little out there, but hear me out. Starseeds, you guys tend to have a lot of unusual experiences. And I'm not just talking about that. One time you thought you saw a ghost in your grandma's attic. I'm talking about the kind of experiences that make you question everything you thought you knew about reality. Maybe you've had vivid dreams that felt more real than real life. Or maybe you've seen strange lights in the sky that you just can't explain. Some star seeds even report having psychic abilities or past life memories. Now I know this all sounds a little crazy, but trust me, you're not alone. These experiences are more common than you think, especially among star seeds. You see, your energy is different, your frequency is higher, and that makes you more attuned to the unseen realms. So if you've ever had an experience that made you feel like you were Alice falling down the rabbit hole, congratulations! You might just be a star seed. Chapter six, saving the world one hug at a time. Star seeds, you guys are here on a mission and that mission is to make the world a better place. You have this innate desire to help others to heal the planet, to spread love and light wherever you go. It's like you have a cosmic calling to leave Earth a little bit brighter than you found it. You might be drawn to careers in healing, teaching, or activism. Or maybe you just have a knack for making everyone around you feel loved and supported. Whatever your path, know that your contributions matter. Star seeds are natural leaders, even if you don't always feel like it. Your energy is contagious, your passion is inspiring, and your heart is pure gold. So never underestimate the power of your light, my friend. Keep shining bright and watch as you attract others who are also here to make a difference. Together, we can create a ripple effect of love and compassion that will transform the world. Chapter seven, you're here for a reason. And finally, the most telling sign that you might be a starseed. You have this deep down knowing that you're here for a reason. You might not know what that reason is yet, and that's okay. The universe works in mysterious ways, but trust that you are exactly where you're supposed to be, doing exactly what you're supposed to be doing. Your soul has a plan, my friend, even if your mind hasn't quite caught up yet. So embrace the unknown, trust the journey, and never give up on your dreams. You are a starseed, a child of the cosmos, a beacon of light in a world that desperately needs your unique gifts. Never forget that. So are you ready to transform your life and reach levels of success and happiness that you never dreamed possible? Click the link in the description below this video to discover a 5,000 year old Egyptian frequency secret to manifest money effortlessly like the top 0.1%. You are a star. Thanks for watching. If you resonated with these signs, you might just be a star seed. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon for more intriguing content. See you next time. And hey, even if you don't identify as a star seed, that's cool too. We're all on our own unique journeys and we all have something special to offer the world. So keep exploring, keep questioning and keep shining your light because the world needs what you've got.